Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. We are out in the open with me and Jade today. She's laying down on her mat on the floor in the living room, kind of learning to push herself off and like crawl and stuff like that. I gave her some carrots earlier. I have a video that I recorded on my phone. I'm going to insert it here so you guys can see. And um, that was exciting. But I bought her some new um, nipples for her Phillips Avent bottles that I do have. Because I think last night I was feeding her. And I'm just like, why does it look like she's working so hard for this milk? Only to realize that it's time to change her nipples. So I bought some new ones, so we're going to change those out for the girl. Yeah. About four. She has four bottles. I have to see what the section is like. Definitely have to wash these and then boil them. Comes in the cutest little holder. Guys, I have this little bib here that you like put on the baby as like a blouse and that has to be the best thing that I ever purchased. And I had purchased that from Temu before uh, Mia was even born and I'm telling you, I really do enjoy it because I have these crackers that I bought at Walmart that she really does like, but when she eats them, it gets everywhere on the high chair, on her clothes and everything. And I don't want to have to strip her down because you know it's the winter time and it's kind of cool inside here. So I don't want to have to strip her down to give her the cracker. And I want her to be able to enjoy it. So. I think about these doctor's offices. They're going to charge you for everything. Yeah, so I want her to be able to enjoy it. So I, um. I put that on her. And then afterwards, all I have to do is just rinse that off really quickly. I think it's waterproof too because her clothes has never gotten dirty. It's just amazing. If you have a little, you definitely need that. So I have her on the floor. Let me show you guys her. <gasps> she completely turned around. I had her turn the other direction and she completely turned around. Amazing. She's moving around. Hi, girl. Hi, honey. I have not done her hair for the day yet, so her hair looks a little wild. But I think I'm going to do it right now. It's 12.50. I could still do it. It's fine. It doesn't matter what time of the day it is. I'm going to do my baby's hair. So I'm going to do her hair in a second. The living room floor is chaotic because she got so many toys for Christmas and they're all over the floor. But I love it. I think it gives her targets to reach for. I have this thing that I need to set up that my work wife bought for her right here. So I need to figure that out. Oh. Oh, wow, I was so zoomed in. So I need to figure that I'm going to try and see if I can put it together today. I don't really know. We're going to try and see so she can have it to um, use. And it's suitable for all stages of development that she is supposed to be going through. So that's exciting. Um, so, yeah, I'm boiling some water so I can pour it on the nipples to sterilize them. And then I'm going to swap them out last night. swapping them out last night my love was not having the best night at all her dad called me when i was at work and he's just like she's crying i'm like oh okay so <laughs> can't figure it out anyways we ended up giving her he ended up ended up walking him through giving her some bright mixture and she was she went to sleep i don't know I don't know if maybe her stomach hurts couldn't tell but you know trial and error error with these babies what i also ended up doing was that i um oh that's my phone i yesterday i started thawing a couple of bags of my breast milk because she had the run the runs for a couple of days so i ended up thawing a couple of bags of my breast milk and put it in like 
the pitcher that I have for her breast milk in the fridge. And like I've been mixing the breast milk with the formula in the bottles again, just to, you know, help her little stomach. And also the breast milk that I've been thawing are the ones from like when I just started breastfeeding. So, you know, whatever bit of colostrum was left would have been in those bags. So I'm like, you know, we got to work on her little stomach. So I did just that. So we're going to change out her nipples. We have four bottles. I'm going to leave it on for a few minutes and let it um, sterilize as it is boiling water. Jules and I are supposed to go out um, this weekend. Um, so that's exciting because we, her and I together, have not gone anywhere in a long time. So I'm very excited about that. Last weekend... No, the weekend before last, Jody and I were supposed to go out. And if it's one thing Jody is gonna do is play dead in my face and then smile, telling me that she thinks I knew better. Because she's gonna tell me that she wants us to go out and I'm gonna believe her and I'm gonna make plans accordingly and we don't go anywhere. And that is exactly, ow, ow, ow. That's exactly what happened, she played me. We didn't go anywhere. So I have some milk for her hair. I have six ounces and we have the new nipples all oh, this one you can actually see it coming out the other ones that i had the other stage what was that stage four and this one is i think stage six. Oh, stage five so the stage four it doesn't spray out nothing comes out no matter how hot it is or anything nothing comes out but this stage six because she's six months you know that sprays out so we're gonna give her the milk in a little bit i'm just leaving her on the floor so she could you know explore and get her footing because see she's turning around she's turning around she's figuring it out but you know she just needs that <laughs> that doesn't happen often enough which i have so much mom guilt about but you know i'm letting her figure it out so I'm going to try and see if I can put her little thing together while the things steam and we'll see. We'll see. Guys, I'm so glad that I bought this ottoman for the living room because I was able to store all of the little parts to this table scooter yada 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 in the ottoman. Had I not had that, I don't know where I would have stored those little parts and I'm pretty sure I could store like a lot of her toys in there so everything isn't out at the same time. But right now she's enjoying that. <laughs> Look at her. Hi y'all, a little bit later, me and I are getting ready to go take a nap while I'm exporting a video um, on my computer of like just some gifts that she got and stuff like that just for her to have for her own memory later on when she's like 15 or whatever. Um, so I ordered a package from Walmart. I have these two for wet jet. Yes, I'm Jamaican, but I'm not about to be wringing out no mop in the bathroom and doing all of that. I'm going to get two for pads. I'm going to wipe the floor. I'm going to throw it away. You do what you have to do in your own household. I don't want to hear about it in the comments because I don't care. Stick it on and go. I don't know that these are the best quality, but I wanted to try them out in comparison to the one that's actually for the Swiffer. Um, this looks like it's the Walmart brand, just like how um, uh, Amazon has, what is it called? Slomo? Whatever it's called. But, you know, I'm going to try these out. Especially now that I'm putting Mia down a little bit more. She's going to be on the floor. It's going to need to be wiped constantly. So I'm going to try these out and see how they are. But that just came in the 
meal I fed her. We're going to go to the bedroom. I'm going to change her diaper. I ate something too. And um, we are going to sleep. We're going to sleep. Hey, sweetie. She loves sucking this one finger so very random. Mia Jade's first Christmas. Come on. Honey, you keep dropping these things on the floor. People live below us, you know. Um, honey, honey, honey. Downstairs does not like us right now. You're done. You gotta play with these on the floor. You're too wild. <laughs>